Best Ale with Keeley. Hello. Hi, we're here south of Longmont, Colorado, and I'm going to be discreet uh, about exactly where we are, uh, but we're at some friends, um, Reka and I pronounced that right. Sheldon. Yeah, uh -huh. and Sheldon. Not Sheldon from the... Uh, no. No, not that show. And shell. the chickens. Not that. And we'll show the chickens. And <laughs> oh, here, here. There. I don't know if you can see the. Oh, there they. There they are. They got chickens here. Anyway, let's go back. And uh, this is an update. I did a video. Um, oh, a few months ago, up at. Um, where was that? Um, St. Saint, Malo. St. Malo or St. Catharines on the rock at, at Malo. And that's where we're planning getting married a year from today. Today is September 6th. But this is the reception. This, this is where the reception will be. Right. This is the location of the reception now. We're in the backyard. And it's pretty big backyard. I, I would say that they probably have about an acre here. And uh, so I'm just going to do some videotaping in the backyard. I think it's going to be pretty interesting. We're videotaping it so we have a good idea of the lighting and the shade and where stuff is at for next year. Right. And I'm also doing something else here. I, you know, a few months ago, I picked up a Sony ZV-1 uh, Mark II video camera. And because my other two video cameras, my G5X and my M50 are really showing some signs of wear and tear. Um, so I just, I, I did about four months ago a uh, video at Disneyland and it was really struggling in the dark. This camera here, which is an Osmo, let's see, it's a, Osmo uh, Pocket 3. It's by DJI and it's actually a very hot camera that a lot of the uh, vloggers are using now. So I've actually uh, had gotten somewhat of a deal on one. I actually found one and I went ahead and bought it last week. And uh, so we're just uh, also going to try this one out. I'm not doing a review on it but I just want to go ahead and try it out and see how it works. So come along for the ride with us and uh, we, we'll have a good time uh, this afternoon. And there's Sheldon and Norika. They are our hosts tonight. <laughs> and they're really been great enough to go ahead and let us use uh, their backyard for our reception next year, which is a year ago from today. So we're going to check right. out the position of the sun and all sorts of things, check out chickens and, you know, and here's a panorama, a pan of the backyard. And we want to check out uh, the position of the sun at certain times of the afternoon. So everybody is pretty much here right now. And I don't know if I'm going to do any inter introductions or anything. Some people are okay being on camera and some aren't. But uh, we've been having a drink. I've got something flying around here that either wants to land on me or try to sting me or something like that. But anyway, here we are, we're at Sheldon's and Eureka's. So here's, the this is really nice here. So they're all getting on my case because I, I don't know if you can see this, but I'm growing my hair out. Not for the wedding, I'm just growing it out. So, um, I can't really grow much up here, but I can let the back grow. And of course, I've had the goatee for 
a while and I keep the beard trimmed down and I keep this shaved underneath here. So that's, those are my groomings. Now here comes Keely. I'm gonna, she's, she's bringing all the finger foods out. Let's see what we've got here. Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, this looks good. We've got um, chips. And we've got some fruit and nuts and cheese and some salsa over there. So that looks really good. I've already had some um, some chips and some salsa. The ponytail's a little too far off, but we'll see. Here, I'm getting a chicken here. They're asking me. I see. I told you they're they're all get they're all. They're all getting on my case about having, um, letting my hair grow out. So, so that'll just have to be the way it is. We want, we want to know when we're being recorded to, so we don't say anything. Right now. Uh oh, don't, you don't have to worry about that because I can edit things in. Well, I can't really edit things in, but I can edit a lot of things out. So. Does she work every day and maintain oh, she still house? works with you? So, <coughs> she worked like years ago. <coughs> so, yes, she made all of this. Well, she, she has all this and she was working every day. Well, she, she we're congratulating Rekha uh, because the other day, that's what Rekha right straight ahead. The other day she became an American. She became an American citizen. And she is from Germany. And Dawn just showed up. Dawn's a friend of Keeley's. And Linda and Tom are over here. They showed up just a while back. I'm going to get up and walk around the backyard in a little bit here. And we're, we're starting to get besieged with, uh, I guess, bees or yellow jackets. So I just told our hosts and our guests that uh, I'm going to walk around the yard and start doing some filming. But we got here around 4.30 and the sun was quite a bit higher. Now it's, uh, I don't know if you can see it through this tree here. Oh, there we go. Um, those way in the back, I haven't learned how to zoom, by the way, but those are the Rocky Mountains. Um, we got some squirrels running around. So I'm going to start by walking this way. And... There's their swimming pool. We kind of turned down an offer to go swimming. And you got a beautiful yard here. I guess that must be a wasp trap or something. Or, oh no, or, or those are for lighting. I guess those are for lighting. But there's their little small swimming pool and I guess they were saying that there was a, uh, a bumblebee nest underneath the deck here and there's the house and I don't know if you could see everybody back there but I just wanted to take a little spin around here now I want to be careful because I don't want to get stung by anything and then here's like a little fireplace and there's a um, little area there to sit and let's go up here. Now they don't have any dogs or anything but they do have four four chickens. I, I don't know if I chicken coop is over here but they've got like four 
chickens running around here. And what Sheldon said is this field this year, they're growing corn. And he said uh, when they harvest it, they, they grow corn, let's see, for uh, feeding purposes. Not for humans, but for the animals here. I'm going to probably get the sun in here. Yep, there's the sun. And the growers here switch these out every year to some other grain. Uh, let's see, let's go back. There's the sun. I don't want to get too much of the sun. There's a supply shed and they've got a place where you can play horseshoes. I'm not a really good horseshoe player, but let's see what I can do. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and make Let's see if I can make a, enough of a fool of myself. Let's see. Oh, well, that's not too bad. I can think of much worse. And there's my shadow. And here's... It's not the backside of water that you would find at Disneyland or any any place like that, but that's the back side of their covered porch or whatever whatever you would want to call that back here. So let's walk over here. So here's the horseshoe that I just threw. And I'm gonna put I'm gonna, let's see, I'll put the horseshoe right there. There's the shed. There's an old table. This is really cool here in Colorado because you find so much of this really cool stuff. Now here's an, another angle of the backyard. This is the chicken coop. And there's the staircase. Oh. Oh, down there, there we go. There's a staircase right there. And I guess this is the chicken hotel that they stay in during the winter. Oh, and here comes, here comes one. It's probably, he or she is probably wondering what am I doing here? But hi, hi there. You're a good chicken, aren't you? Oh, we got two of them now. Yeah, and I don't see any roosters here. How are you two? Yeah, I'm talking to these two chickens now. Here comes the third one. And uh, I'm not so worried about me talking to the chickens, but when they start answering back and I can understand them, then I start worrying about myself. So, uh, but here's... the chickens. What are you up to? Are you two? Oh, I bet you two are probably thinking I'm going to put food out. That's probably it. Well, I'm not going to do that. I'll get in trouble. Oh, oh, look at that. Nice. <clears throat> I'm going to come right here's the fourth one. So, oh yeah, and this one's flapping its wings. Beautiful chickens, I got to say. Yeah. So are you talking? You guys are make, making some noise here. Oh yeah, these are definitely spruce trees. See a lot of these in Colorado. I think these are blue spruces. And then, um, so this is really just fantastic yard. This will be great a year from now when we're planning on getting married and we'll have the reception here. And here's the back of Ureka and Sheldon's home. We've got here I'll raise the camera and I'm also checking my camera out. I think this is where the bar is going to be. It's going to be inside here. And we already have a bartender. 
uh, at least now. You know, a lot can change between now and a year from now. And this looks like uh, a rose. Well, and they have some uh, raspberries here. I've already... Let's see if I can... Let's see. There, there's... There's a raspberry. That looks good. Mmm. Tastes good, too. There, there's some more raspberries. Oh, there's... There's a lo lot of uh, yellow jackets in here. And I'm not really... Sure what these are in here. I'm sure there's yellow jackets and bees. But they're all they're all good. They're all good pollinators. And what was over here? These are yellow squash, yellow zucchini. And this is a perfect length, by the way. I think this is about eight inches okay. that is a perfect length I, I would harvest that one right now but boy those look great those look absolutely wonderful but but here's the yard here's looking west the big peak in the background right underneath the uh, phone lines or utility lines that is uh, Long's Peak that's a 14er and then to the right of that, about just above where the umbrella is, is Twin Sisters. I've climbed that. <laughs> then there's a peak over to the left, which is St. Vrain. And that was the first 12,000 foot peak that I hiked up. So it's about 6.30. You can see the sun. See, I gotta get. Let's see, there, get, get the horizon in. You can see the sun off to the right, but I'm gonna go ahead now. This tree here, which has been supplying us shade through late afternoon, and, and did I just say it's about 6.30? Now, the umbrella is in the sun. That's why they have the umbrella up. You can see my shadow. There's the house. Oh, Sheldon put the chickens in their coop. He put the chickens away. But there's the neighbor's yard. But this is where the shadow on this big tree is now. So the shadow is over here. That's, that looks like a blue spruce. And I'm gonna put myself in the shade over here. There. Boy, it just cooled off. As soon as I got in the shade, it cooled off about five degrees. And there's part of what's gonna be our wedding party. There's their beautiful house. That's the shed where the bar will be. And uh, just did a little panorama. But I got out of the way of the sun, so gorgeous here. Okay, so here's the porch, the backyard porch. I don't want to get too far out there because that sun is really coming in bright. It's not really coming in hot, it's just coming in bright. So I'm walking towards the real main part. And here's a table. Oh, we got, we got a, we got a cactus. Yeah, we got a cactus here. This is interesting because this is Col <laughs> this is Colorado. This isn't the Southern California deserts. Well, but this is right. So, so and, and you see, this is fake. 
Oh, these are these there's, are the fake. There's uh, lights in there. These are the fake. Oh, there's lights in there. We want to be careful <laughs> here. I don't need that. I'm growing my hair out, and I don't need lice. No lights. lights. Oh, lights, lights. I thought she said lice. No. No, she I, said I, I lights. Okay, lights. L i g h t s. But now I'm. So here's. I was listening to one of the YouTubers today, earlier, this, this guy, he does quite a bit with Adam the Woo when Adam is up in Philadelphia, but he, he his uh, saying is, here we are. So here we are in uh, just south of Longmont, Colorado. And there's Eureka and Keeley. They're going to go out and... Here, I'm going to get... Yeah, so the whole there's some conversation going on. I'm down at the basement oh, level. That's, that's cool. I, I know Sheldon I was describing then, then, what this yeah. is. The, in here, the inside of the and we're right just set, about right at there. sunset, and we got mosquitoes coming out. Oh, no, I already got bit. <laughs> oh, I just thought I'd come down here to get a picture. Here's Keeley downstairs, and I'm checking out the nightlight. They call this the bank. They call it the bank because... Look what's over here. This is a nice, big, heavy, antique safe. I don't know what year it's from. Probably from the 18... Wow, Keeley just said 1840. Wow, I can barely move that door. Nice. And I noticed over here, this is really interesting. Um, there's some guitars. There's a cello. And some acoustics. It's a Washburn, an Ibanez, and then there's no electric while that. Let's see. Oh, that's a wow, well, that's a Paul Reed Smith. That might be an original, that might be one of the early. And then a couple of Fender amps. I would I would imagine that oh, there's a couple backgammon games. Remember that? Nice. Oh, and there's uh there's a picture of Albert Einstein. Okay, so it's a little after seven o'clock. And I'm out here, the sun is in the process of setting. And I wanted to get an idea of what the light was going to be like in the backyard. So I'm not going to turn the camera around yet. Or I'll, I'll turn it around here. But here's the coloring. There's Keeley. Another mosquito. I, got, I think I said I got nailed in my arm by a mosquito but and we've been seeing uh, geese flying back and forth and there's a lake south of here which apparently the geese like to uh, um, spend the night at and then north of here I guess there's some fields where they like to feed So now there's Keeley and Dawn. Keeley was trying to get some pictures, Dawn. So as you can see, the light is starting to diminish. Let's see. And there's the sun, another mosquito.
So I kind of screwed up here. I think I didn't get the sun set. So the sun has already set. You can see a little bit of the glow. I'll check the camera and see if uh, I in fact did. Now they sprayed me with a little bit of mosquito spray. So they, they weren't nice to do that. So, and as I said earlier, I haven't figured out how to zoom the camera in. I know you can do it with these, but that's not something I figured out yet. We're, we're I think, gonna come sit out here. Oh, there's another mosquito hanging out with the camera. But I think I'm gonna go over here, pro probably spray on some repellent. Okay, so this is Bruce's last is nail, that? and I'm Pandora? sitting here with okay. three women and one of my, uh, you know, male friends here, and they're all talking about the arrangements for the uh, reception a year from now, and uh, I need to close the video out. So this is Bruce's last nail, and Keely is, uh, let's see, Cheers. okay, there we go, I'm still... Still getting used to this thing. I'll probably have to use it quite a few times to get used to the gimbal, how the gimbal works. And I'll try to figure out the zoom. But uh, but again, this is Bruce, the last nail. And I'm glad you came along for the ride with us. Take care. And, uh, and by the way, I just want to say that if you've watched the video this much, uh, I think you're just absolutely awesome. Thank you, Yorika and Sheldon. You're awesome. We love you. Okay, yeah. Bye. Bye bye. Woo! <laughs> That's awesome. No, he's just like red and green or something. So. Love. <laughs> I'm so all about the lights. I don't even know. Fairy lights know. everywhere and every inch of my life is like every, yes. Every kind of light. Mm-hmm. Um, to the trees only because this is seizure material. But oh, I love it. Right. Yes. I love it. Seizure material, yeah. Totally. Yeah. This is seizure material. <laughs> you have to <laughs> Don't you agree? I agree. Maybe, but I still want it. Yeah, isn't that cool? Yes. Um, so, if you, Sheldon, point it towards the spruce tree. It takes a little fine tuning, oh, but you can have that. it at the. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.